Um, I played and I don't know if this is on the road because mm-hmm. I was overseas. We did a festival. That's on the road. Flavo Fest. Well, I mean, what That's was actually like interesting really about this, <laughs> what was actually interesting about this story is uh, we played a festival in Holland. Um, and then a week later, uh, that festival was called Flavo. Look it up. It's a famous festival. Then a week later, we played a festival c- called Greenbelt. That's also a very famous uh, festival. Still look, in Europe? Look it up. It's in England. England. Okay. So, yes. So, it was like, sweet. We get a, like, <laughs> 10-day vacation in Europe. We're going to play Flavo Fest in Holland. Then we're going to probably just burn some time. And then we're going to go play Greenbelt literally the next weekend. William Morris, being as smart as they are. Right. Uh, booked a John Q Public show in Canada between those two dates are in England. Are you fucking kidding me? Between, between those two dates in England. Okay, wait. I mean, in Europe. So how far apart were the two Europe dates? About eight days. Oh, my God. So we had That's to. That's still too much. We had still too much. Yeah. You're damn right it is. <laughs> Fucking bro, we played at Flavo Fest. And as soon as we got done playing, it was like, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Fucking had to rush us into a cab. And we had to bolt it to the airport to make it to a plane that would fly all the way back. To New York, which is where our van was parked. We had to get in the van and drive five, seven hours north to Canada. So I had to drive. And we played like some festival up there. Had to haul ass <laughs> back down to New York. Get on another plane. Fly back to Europe and land in England and play Flavor Fest. Or I mean, uh, Greenbelt. And then had to get back on a plane, fly back oh, to. God. We flew over the ocean four times in like eight days. That's too much. That is entirely too much. So the whole thing was fucking stressful. Um, but what I was getting at is bad food. Mm, right. Because that was the question. So we we're already like flying there the first time. Kind of excited because I think it was the first time we played overseas. But then also just like this week's going to suck so bad. I saw the movie Happy Gilmer four times in like six days. <laughs> Every flight we had—that's all they were showing—had Happy Gilmore as the That's as the flight as the flight movie. Oh. We get to Holland and we are backstage in the place where they serve food uh, for the Flavo Fest green room. It was Catering. a tent. It was a tent. Gotcha. It was all outdoors. I, I shit you not. <laughs> I shit you not. It was eel. Oh. <laughs> I shit you not. Eel. I, what the oh. fuck? I've been eating fucking plain peanuts and fucking crackers. <laughs> for the, fucking, you did not just put eel in front of me. Fucking fuck this. Fucking I'm leaving. Eel. Eel. And it was like, you know, you guys really. It was like hoity-toity. You're getting, oh, you're getting the treatment. I was like, the fuck I am. I'm not eating eel. Did you eat it? No. (laughs) No, our whole band was just like, fuck that. We're from Missouri. We left and and found some. We don't want that shit. Fuck, I couldn't believe that. We were so hungry and so just like, oh, God, when's the foods? Like, oh, you can go over to this tent, blah, blah, blah. And it was eel. Eel. <sighs> eel. E-E-L. Eel. <laughs> Is there like a lot of eel available in, uh, over there? Uh, I have no idea. But I think that's my worst food story. Oh, that that is pretty darn good. That's freaking good. Fuck yep. Heel. Tune in live every Thursday night at 7 p.m. Central. On the Unsung Screamers Facebook page, YouTube channel, and Twitter. And check out our Unsung Screamers podcast. Wherever you get your podcasts. Ah!